Welcome back to Project Zomboid. It's Rowan here, and today we are kicking off a brand new character. Good old Pete Eggleston. So we are playing as an Axeman. Wow, a lumberjack. We are an Axeman. We're thin-skinned, slow healer, prone to illness, smoker, weak stomach, short-sighted, slow reader. Good old Axeman. Cat size, outdoorsman, lucky, amateur mechanic, fast learner, and strong. So we're already starting off fully maxed out strength and a visitor by the sounds of it. So let's grab what we can, get out of here. Oh man. So we're starting off on just standard, more or less vanilla playthrough because I've just missed it. So I love, absolutely love, um, like the 10 years later and the heavily modded runs, but sometimes you just can't beat good old basic world. And yeah, I'm here for it. I am ready for it. Ah, come on, fella. Ah, crap. We might have done a little whirly. Okay, we're good. So far, so good. Sweet ass. Let's grab some tweezers. Probably should have taken some of their gear. Cool. Let's get out of here. So I've started with, uh, well, we're using Pillars Random st Spawn just to. You know, keep things exciting. So I have no idea where I am or what I'm really gonna do. But yeah, game plan is find something we can hopefully hunker down in and get safe. So first things first. Okay, that's a good sign. Ah, well, I mean, 50-50 sign could mean we're at West Point. So I'm not gonna check the map until I have a rough idea of where I am. Also kinda looks like Valley Station. Yeah, I think this could be Valley Station. Not too sure. Maybe I head directly down, see if we can come to a highway or something. Man. One thing I've not missed is the uh What's it called? Um locked door rate on vanilla. Come on. Stay down. Please. Just want to get in this house. Ah, oh, crap. Oh, we might actually just have to go. Oh. Yeah, we definitely got to go. I want to get in that shed. Shed is where it's at. Come on, come on. Damn it. You're meant to be a strong boy. Oh. Oh. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Just panic noises. And a panicked man. Extremely panicked man. Alright, where are we? Nice little step van. Little parking lot. Garage. Car alarm. Ooh. Ah, yeah, I think we're at Valley Station. Oh, I know where I am. Let's. For one, let's just keep moving, make sure I know exactly where I am. Yeah, I know where we are. Okay, um, burgers, we don't want that. We want to come down this way, I think. We want to get to the main road. Ah, so many Zeds. I forget how busy this place is. So we're playing on very high population too, so we're, we're in for it. It's going to be a mess. It's going to be a mess. Not quite insane. I've had enough of insane. So playing with that Britta's gun mod on insane is just wow, insane. Boss oil. I wonder if they've got an axe for me, or a hammer, or something. Empty gas can. Screw it. May as well. Let's keep moving. Kind of thinking. So miles and miles away, there is a hunter's cabin. One you've seen many a time on this channel, and I want it. I want that to be home for. At least until we get somewhat settled. So I'm going to try and head there if I remember where I'm going. And yeah, hopefully we make it in one piece without getting torn to bits by the countless herds that are waiting for us. This is not fun. I hate starting down here. <laughs> My god, this is ridiculous. Sounds like a can't tell if it's a car alarm or a house alarm, but look at what it's bringing in, man. Jesus. Okay, well this is going to be very, very pleasant. <laughs> oh, I should, if I remember rightly, be able to head directly through these woods to the hunters, hunter's cabin. 
because I've done it before. I can definitely do it again. God, this is just carnage already. We're not even, not even like day one yet. This is just like early doors. Ridiculous. <sighs> okay, I went down a wrong route and I've actually made it to what looks like the old school. And we're heading towards a house alarm. That's inside the building. Wonderful. Which means... Okay, this is actually somewhat good sign. Ah, we don't want to go that way. So just over here is... Come on, brain. Find words. Um, storage town. There we go. Just in here, inside this fence that used to, once upon a time, be a very nice base place. Until they added doors. Now it's not. Ah, oh, no, they removed the doors. Yeah, now it's definitely not. <laughs> but yeah, it's a nice little base spot, really. High fences all around. Two on those jeans. Yeah, it's not, not actually a bad base spot at all. High fences all around. Plenty of storage buildings. Base places, places you can link, you know, just endless opportunities, really. So I do want to see if any of these are actually open, though, because if not, it's not really worth our time. Ah, you can definitely stay closed. Ooh, could do with you. And you. Ooh, got a weapon in there, too. Okay, I thought this was going to work out, but I don't think it is. I think I just need to do a little tactical sprint the whole way through, see what we can get into. Ah, oh, crap. Leather jacket, thank you sir. That's actually a nice one. No. Alright. Let's get out of here. So I'm thinking, now that we're here, if we head in this direction, that'll get us to the hunter's cabin. Which is, yeah, a spot that I do really want to be in. If I can get there, that is. Ah, it's going to have to be a, a bit of a ballsy jump. Screw it. Right here will do. Good lad. Good lad. Alright, we just gotta keep moving. Getting exhausted, we're starting to get thirsty. It's only a matter of time before we get hungry. God. Pain. Pure pain. Let's keep moving. I believe this is actually the road we want. So we've managed to... Managed to wangle it perfectly. I hope. Ah. Could be perfect, could be a nightmare. So we could end up pulling all of the Zeds up this entire road with us, which, yeah, not ideal. Not at all. That's not how we want to kick this off. Oh, man. Ah, nice. We're here, though. It's a good enough start. We just need to get ourselves rested. Oh, do you remember when I died here? I forgot about that. One painful year challenge. Doing the outro. <laughs> I would say it's good to be back, but it's just filling me with memories. <laughs> Alright, uh, not in there. Maybe in here. Ah, crap. It's not even a park bench or anything, sir. So. Alright, um, how can we do this? Um, Alright, I guess first things first. Check any shelves in here. Uh, there's a couple down the end. Nice. We can get to those. We might find a weapon. Anything will do. Just anything better than this plank. Because there's, there's no stopping power to this thing at all. Brilliant. <laughs> Just what we wanted. Um, 
also not good. Can I leave you guys on that? Didn't sound like it. Alright, with any luck. Nope. Had luck, but no time. Ah, crap. No, okay, this is not going to work out how I want it to at all. Um, I'm probably going to have to pull miles back. Ah, even that's dangerous. Um, how can I work my way out of this one? It's been a while since I've had to, had to deal with proper struggle. Oh, I'm not really, uh, <laughs> not really accustomed to this anymore. It's been a long time. <laughs> Unless I can find like a little spot in the woods or maybe just head back down the road. You know, we could even try and get one of those cars. Just thinking about it, just to drop the exhaustion. So as soon as I drop the exhaustion, I'll be fine. Alright, made it out of the woods alive. Did get a little scratch on our forearm. Not ideal, but we're in one piece and that's what matters. We might be extremely exerted, but hopefully we don't just have to walk to our death. There's another car. That could do it. What do you reckon? Spend the night in there? Risky, but probably doable. As long as no Zeds come crawling out the woodwork. Could actually be alright. Okay. Oh man. Extremely good start. You've just got to go back down. Thank you. Come on. Ah, oh, great. Ooh, he does have a bag, though. Oh, I'm slowly digging myself even more of a hole there. Yep. That's the final nail. Gotta have this. <laughs> There's no other way. Alright, I think we've nailed it. We had a good little system and it just kept working. Oh man, it's like a dream come true. It's like a dream come true. Let's take the school bag. Let's maybe take the pencil just in case. Yes, get in. Alright, let's get some sleep. Hopefully, we're all good come morning. Oh man. We made it through the night. Our paintings cleared up and someone was nice enough to gift us a nice pack of cigs and some matches during the night. So we had, oh, and a watch. I missed that. Get that on our left wrist straight away. But yeah, I uh, got woken up once during the night by two Zeds. Managed to take care of them. All good. Ooh. Beautiful. Got actually a functioning car. I'm definitely going to take the key for you and check it out. But yeah, we're just down the road from where we want to be. So I think ridiculous. Good battery though. Definitely coming handy. And then we've got that pencil. May as well just pen her in. Yeah. I wonder if there's one for gas. Nah. Oh well. Alright, so we've got a car key. We've got no weapons. We've got barely anything else. Nothing but a hope and a prayer. So I'm have some canned beans as well. So we head up on a full stomach. Nice. Oh man, I thought it was going to get grabbed again then. Double whammy. Get out of here.
It's like so, so easily forgotten how weak you are when starting a new playthrough. It's painful. So painful. Okay, uh, what can we leave behind? Empty tin can. Perfect. That'll do. That'll do, donkey. That'll do. Ah, we don't have a weapon to get in the room. To clear out any windows or anything. Ah, that's not ideal. Nothing too crazy. Wonder if there's anything in the trunks. Even like... Well, just anything. Any sort of tool would do me nicely. Absolutely nothing. They crashed the cars, but they locked them up. Locked them all up. Uh, wrench. That'll do. That'll get me inside. That might cause a lot of unnecessary tension, but it's life. Siphon gas. This car got gas. No key, matches, and some smokes. Ah, I need that. That's the button we want to click. Ooh, brand new battery, lug wrench. Nice. Actually quite handy. Not a bad little find. Alright, plan still stands. Get in this window. Oh, we just got to go through the pain first. Tell you what, this whole trip should be great for our sneaking skill though. I'm ready for those games. Twenty-five oh three. It's not a good sign. Yeah, it means we're spotted. Sweet ass. Any more for any more? Ooh, key straight off the bat, nice. Come on, there's got to be something. Hopefully not just ammo. Not even a shotgun. Okay, maybe this place wasn't the best shout. So it's great for a lot of things, but not really what we want, unfortunately. Damn it. Ah, it's not good. This is not good. Definitely take all of you. Nothing in here either, was there? Couple boxes of nails, they'll come in handy somewhere, I'm sure. And singular bar from Zed. Good night. Wonder if they got into that shed for us. Or if I'm gonna have to do, do the dirty work. Ah, nice to dig it in. Result. Alright, hopefully we can get some sort of weapon in there. So it's usually a pretty well stocked tool shed. So, here's hoping, eh? One lonely little Zed. Um, saw. Club hammer. Ah, crap. That's what I heard. Tons of them. Ah, crap. There really is tons of them. <laughs> this is not what I had in mind, guys. No, we're just gonna have to we're gonna have to pick these off, aren't we? Well, I expected a couple, but this is just ridiculous. Come on, fellas. Just separate enough to give me some space. That's all I ask. 
Alright, let's do a little loop de loop. Hopefully, we can pull a couple. There we go. That's what we want. Nice. Okay. There's going to be a lot of that. I reckon we can clear this. Let's just get her done. Yeah, ended up working out quite nicely on just a big train. So, nailing it. Absolutely nailing it. And one more swing for the road. Beautiful. It's nice when it works out. Even if it did almost kill us, it worked out in the end. Digital watch. Yeah, none of that. Um, we should probably take care of these guys too. Oh, that's not what I wanted. Oh. <laughs> Day one, ladies and gents. Ooh. Screwdriver. That's what we want. So I was really hoping we'd get like even like a hand axe out of all of this but yeah we haven't even mustered one of those up unfortunately good old reliable trusty little wrench is going to save the day for the first time in forever alright come on let's just swing our way to victory alright the kill train should actually be here now oh man it's just arrived in the station are you going to be a winner? you are indeed This is the result of hundreds of swings just being pulled off into one little one little run. Let's grab ourselves a holster. Um, whatever happened to that screwdriver, I want it. Ah, just spotted you. Screwdriver. I might take that hoodie too. Bit of extra protection. Make us feel a little bit more invisible. It's always nice. Garbage bag, empty bottle. Hmm, could come in handy, probably won't. Yeah, still not really any guns, which, not ideal, but also not the end of the world, because I'm not going to be using them anyway. <laughs> not anytime soon. Proper hammer, beautiful. Might just be able to get this place boarded. And we've got a saw, don't we? Yeah, nice. Alright, let's get some little bits of protection in and ready. Even just for like this back room or something, so we can get a good night's sleep. No, I knew we're not gonna have a door. Maybe we board up one of these rooms. Couple more Zeds for the road. Let's get ourselves a window to pull them through. Hopefully, make life fairly easy. Nice. I need more of that, please. More of that, please. Please, <laughs> please come in. Oh, he's getting creative. Trying to pull the old flankaroo. Get out of here. There's one, and there's two. Nice. Oh man, what a day already. Day one. This ridiculous already, but we're alive. We're uh, 50 Zeds in, one day, two hours, and we're alive. It's the only thing that matters. Ah, we're exhausted too. And that little sprint has definitely just drawn even more of them. Might have to go reuse our window. Yep. Let's go. <laughs> Oh, it's just carnage. And that exhaustion's not going to help one bit. Um, that's the window we want. Can we do it? As soon as one gets up, we've got to go. There we go. Much better. A little bit more separation. So I think that is my top tip to bite and zeds. Just make sure they're separate enough. You don't have to be constantly pushing and swinging and things like that. Because that's when problems start. And the wrench is broken. Hammer. Stop. Hammer time. Whenever you're ready. 
Whenever you're ready. There we go. I might just do a little loop de loop, otherwise, yeah, we're gonna start pulling them out of the woodwork. It's not what we want. Get them in there, fellas. Let's get the train going again. Nice. Get there in the end. So it looks like it got messy, but it was kind of very, very controlled. So I managed to lose them on a window, and they just ended up swinging and swinging until they didn't swing anymore. Did we get a needle? We did. I could probably just rip all of this up and start smashing out some, uh, what do you call it, straight off the bat. Um, tailoring. There you go. Be nice if I could find that leather coat. Beautiful. All right. Get any twine? Thread? Whatever you want to call it. Not bad. Not bad, not bad. I guess we just break everything down. Probably get zero planks out of it. Yep. And we're not going to get any planks. Let's just grab a chair, take it through to the toilet, get cosy, and... Yeah, create our nice little resting spot. Probably not in this one. Probably not a good idea. This one will do. wonder if we got any XP out of that at all. 4.8. Not really ideal. Not at all. Oh, I'm probably going to... Hmm, still quite early. Maybe we just make a little stock pile or something. Grab out what gear we actually need from here. And sort of get myself ready to move, I guess. Take some club hammers. Uh, welder's mask for sure. Uh, maybe a trowel. Shovel. There's my big two-hander. Still got plenty of space in there. So grab a lug wrench. And maybe the actual wrench. So that wrench was a bit of a bit of a lifesaver. So yeah, we'll take that too. Nice. Club hammer on the left belt. Club hammer on the right belt. Try and use number three first. Guess we have a proper scope through and see if we've actually got any guns at all. No. Well, it might be worth heading just down the road to the actual hunter's cabin. Not too far away. So it's just off the just off the main road that we came up in. But I think that's all we're gonna have time for today. So it's off to a pretty good start. Um killed a fair amount of Zeds, got one not very tasty scratch, but I reckon we got this. So I'm gonna have a nice little smoke. Say goodbye. So yeah, thanks for watching. Massive thanks to remember supporting the channel. Like, subscribe if you enjoyed. Hopefully, stick around for the next one. Peace.